What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of the Deadline Mode Invitational Day 4 PKing. Uh, there was no Day 3 video because we did PK a little bit here and there, but we actually did end up dying to Magd on a DC. And I wasn't recording because my recorder was paused and it didn't look like a very obvious DC. Um, it looked like I just kept KO normally, so I didn't make a big deal out of it and I didn't ask him to refund me or anything. Anyway, he's being DQ'd now from the tournament for uh, breaking a different rule, so there's no way I would have got any of that stuff back anyway. Uh, my team Cutthroat decided to re-gear me. Here are the stats. I will be probably, you know, geared up and maxed for the final as well. But today we're just going to be PKing with the same gear. Got Piety, VLS. Let's see how it goes. If you guys do enjoy the video, hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching. So I didn't really plan on including many day three clips, but here's the most important one. Um, I did actually get on this guy who had a whip at the, what's it called? The Neves uh, Slayer Dungeon or whatever, now known as Steve's, I think, on the real game. And yeah, I caught him all the way east at Bloodvelts with a whip, and this was on day three. It was one of the first whips in game. It was worth about three mil at the time. He was all the way east. He was alking while he did it. Now my friend was actually doing his Slayer task next to him. You can see the purple dot on the mini map, and I was under the impression that this guy was like completely out of food because apparently he wasn't prayer flicking and is keeping his HP very low. So I thought it's a guaranteed whip kill because I honestly didn't think I had the stats to do it otherwise if he had supplies. And then I start seeing him. Yeah, there you can see I also VL aspect him about on half HP at zero off prayer. So, as soon as I saw him start healing at the full on shit, I, th I thought, okay, this is a Lost Claws. Lost Claws? Lost Claws, sorry. And uh, it was kind of a waste of time, but obviously I'd already attacked him. I might as well commit and try and kill him. Used all four VLS specs at, the point. Not at this point, nothing too significant. Nothing doing a lot of damage. Here, I think I splashed like three freezes in a row, and he gets a lot of distance. He does mess up there while running west. And I just stay on him. I didn't actually realize how far east he was, and if I caught every single freeze and two-stepped it every single time, probably would have been a definite kill because he had to run loads and loads of minimaps. You can see the exits that uh, enter that, that door just the west there. So I still had a couple freezes left in me if I caught every single one and two stepped it. Here you can see I mess up a little bit, let him get a couple extra steps. Do end up catching it. This is my second last freeze. Basically, if I time my freeze perfectly, I can get him like a two steps before the exit. But if I miss it and I don't get it in one freeze or I splash, he's gone. So, you know, it's now or never, I have to get the kill. He's a lot higher combat level than me. 109 combat on day three with a whip. I'm just auto casting the barrage right now. You can see I click off there and just managed to refreeze him in time. My last freeze possible, I'm going for that VLS, hit a nine. At this point, I realize, okay, he's out of food. I just need to put in the damage. So I fake you a VLS every single time and just keep bolting him. You can see every time I pull out the VLS, he prays melee and I just bolt him. There you can see, I do it one more time. I thought he was dead there. He literally got red barred. One more time, I think I got him five times in a row there. And I think that was the first whip PK of the tournament because it was like around 72 hours in. And the whip was around 3 mil. So, yeah, good fight. Alrighty, what is the loot off the guy with the Abyssal Whip? Open the Diamond Chest. 1 mil key. He had the bones for piety, 600 death runes, 20 brews, 280 wrath runes, rune plate legs, rune plate body, blood runes. That is the biggest key so far I've had this tournament. Plus the whip. That's a 3 mil plus PK. He was that close to escaping, but I got him with all the fakies. One mil key. Freeze it. There we go. Oh, the skull. Oh my god, bro, what is he doing? He has like no HP. What is he doing? Vest the longsword, please. Oh my god, a 40. I'm just gonna go again through the prayer. Uh, never mind, no, I'm not allied. He had like no HP. Is he trolling? Go again? He's walking. He's dead, right? I'm just gonna go again. Dead? <sighs> What is he doing, bro? He had a D skim and everything. He had two emblems as well. What? I think he. Just, I think he even got a tell it. He just got done with his trip. Jesus Christ. I don't remember what he did. Bro, what is this? And why? And more importantly, is he sculled up? What the hell? Going for the VLS. Why is he sculled up, man? I'll whack him there. I gotta go for it just because he's sculled. I'm so confused. Is he smited here? Oh fuck. I don't even think it's going, worth going for the refreeze there. I'll catch it here then. Drink a stamina as well. Freeze him before the thing? Nice. Let's drop a shark. Uh, do I have knives? I do. Because I feel like, I don't know, if I smite this guy with knives, he's probably gonna die. Let's just be a lesson before he goes in for it. Jesus. Now just knife him with an Amazon. 
I could probably kill him with a VLS to be fair. Is he dead? No way did he tank that. Just VLS him again? Good fight, dude. I don't know why you're scalded up on demo mode in that gear, but I'm gonna kill you for it, unfortunately. Come on, bro. Don't be don't be acting like you don't know. Don't be acting like you don't know. Hit a bear and shit. A Bolton. Whack him. I don't want to spec yet. Zero. I think he knows I have a VLS. So there's no point trying to hide it. Go for a range, cause yeah. VLS dead. 55. See, I can't hit 55s. I'm just gonna go in. Fuck, man. I can literally hit 55s. Oh, I could have bulk KO'd him there as well. VLS dead, please? 54 for the KO, holy shit. Oh my god, he had a glory as well. I think that's still like 100k. Jeez. Oh my god, look how many prayer pots he had. What is this guy doing, bro? He's gonna get that prayer on, right? Yeah, he is. 24. I guess we just gotta fake it the VLS loads because I think it's just gonna camp right melee. Let's go for another one. And go one just before he's unfrozen. He changes prayers as well. Oh, what did I just do there? And I splashed. Catch it. There we go, nice. He's gonna pray melee there. Let's go for another bolt. Another one. Free freeze, nice. Fake the VLS. He's definitely just gonna camp prime melee. Oh my god, he pray he changes prayers as well. 19. I right, refreeze him in a second. Wanna catch it? There we go. Come on, I've done so much damage to him in such little time, dude. How many- is he stacking brews or something? Whack. He's gonna play range there. 15. Dead? Good fight, dude. Oh, how was that name? He had raw sharks? Why did he have raw sharks? Please freeze him. Please freeze him. Please freeze him. There we go, nice. Bolt. Come on, VLS, if there's any, any time to hit a full. Okay. Good fight. Not bad at all, Runeful. Oh, he had no food on him, bro. What is he doing? It's a 30 minute skull, but he could have a bunch of chins, you never know. Go for a freeze. VLS, dead? Dead. How many chins is the question? Only 25. Oh well. I'll keep the key though, in case he's not muling. But, or I mean, giving it to a team or someone. But I'm pretty sure he is, so it's probably only going to be 25 chins. Which means Deez is like 50k, but... Uh, I'm not going to complain with free 50k, you know? They're all going to be terrible. Please... 292k. I think that might be the guy who had 20 prayer pots. This is 16 shocks, that's good, prayer pot. 249k, 300 nats, 44k cash, 4 prayer pots, 300 bolt I'm actually really happy with that as well. 229k, 280 raw sharks, 20, that's 300 sharks right there, 23k cash, a Morgan's Javelin. That is so, those are really nice keys, I'm super happy. This one is terrible, but I'm super happy with those keys. That's sick. Oh, this is the level 77 from earlier. We're already 30 minutes, so we might as well. He's got rune and shit. It's worth it. Two hit. Good fight, dude. Fuck, I forgot looting bag again. It's awkward. Uh, where's the black D at? There it is. I think he's doing Worldly Slayer as well. Can we freeze him? Did he X log? Of course I splashed the freeze, dude. Please freeze him there. Okay, we got him off the door. I was just pumping the Villa specs. This should be a D skim. 54, Jesus. Is he gonna pray? 
54-52 for the freest D scam in my career. Yikers. I'm sorry, man, but it's a D scam and a black dead body. And whatever's in your key. GG, dude. Come on, VLS. Uh... Oh my god, he changed his prayers as well. Please, please? He smited. Please just kill him. Please. We got him. We got him. That should be a really big kill. D skim. Barrow's gloves. Or oh, what? 90k? Maybe the fifth key is good. He said it wasn't, but he's a level 100 and he had D skim 100k. Either way, the loot's are all good, so I don't really mind. Open Emma chest. 103k to start it off and 133k. The rest all 30ks. Uh, 11 Ranner Weeds, that's 11 Prayer Pots right there, so that's sick. 100 Nath, that's really good as well. Then, yeah. 30k, just some general stuff. Death Runes, Garages. 11k Cash, 180 Lobs, not bad. Not the greatest though. And that was pretty shitty, but we did get a lot of loot out of it. 106 Fishing. I don't think we'll be able to kill him, but we can try. Jeez. 44. I think he just came back. Does he not have any food? Okay, hopefully that'll be a good key. I saw him training earlier. His name's literally AFK Dead Man. Uh, I don't know, man. 106 combat fishing, you never know. Because mine as well, right? That's lit. Jesus. <sighs> Doubt the key is even worth. Oh, we had an emblem. Honestly, that's worth it then. Two emblems? Okay. That is worth it. I lied. I'm a big fat liar. I'm a big fat liar. He's forming pouches, I think, for lit. Please, two hit him. Oh, fuck. I'm just gonna go again. Dead. He uses his escape off to the west, so he doesn't expect to die. So surely he has chins. 11 chins. Fuck. He, I don't know what this escape is, but somehow he uses it, and he's been catching loads of chins. I assume he's giving the other the chins to the other account now, though, so that's a waste, but could have paid off. What do you need for this? Does anyone know? Oh my god. And I can't even freeze the dude. I did not see his combat level. May or may not have re these skulls. Oops. Worst five keys to possibly ever exist. But they are to end the stream and the video. Open down my chest. 178k first one. Okay, this seems to be the only good one. 112 sharks. That is actually amazing. That is more than I could ask for. Then yeah, these are all terrible. Uh, 20 more sharks. And, uh, yeah, last one I guess. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video right now. We are just training, we just got ourselves 95 attack, and now we're working on defense. Hopefully we can get our range up a little bit. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. I'm pretty sure I'll be peaking again tomorrow, I'm not sure. I actually did a 6 hour PK stream, so if you're not following my Twitch, make sure you follow it. There's a link in the description. Anyway, if you guys did enjoy the VLS PKing, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching.